Not all atomic nuclei are stable. If the ratio of protons to neutrons is off, the forces inside the nucleus can't hold it together forever. So the atom changes, it decays. Radioactive decay is a natural process where unstable atoms release particles or energy to become more stable. It's spontaneous and random but predictable on average, which is why we talk about half-lives, the time it takes for half of a sample to decay. There are three major types of decay. Alpha decay happens in heavy elements like uranium or radium. The nucleus emits an alpha particle, two protons and two neutrons, basically a helium nucleus. This reduces the atom's mass and shifts it down the periodic table. In beta decay, the nucleus changes the identity of a particle. A neutron becomes a proton, releasing an electron and an antineutrino. That's beta minus decay. Or a proton becomes a neutron, releasing a positron and a neutrino. That's beta plus. This adjusts the balance between protons and neutrons. Gamma decay is different. There's no change in the number of particles, just a release of excess energy as high-frequency electromagnetic radiation. It often follows alpha or beta decay, like the nucleus settling down after a change. Radioactive decay powers nuclear reactors, radiation therapy, PET scans, even the warmth of Earth's core. It's also how we measure the ages of ancient rocks and fossils through radiometric dating. It may be invisible, but radioactive decay is one of the most important processes shaping the universe and life on Earth.